Hello everybody, my name is Samaria, and welcome to Horse Life! They've just added the Market World, um, they plan more features, but for now we have auctions. So I feel like we could go check that out. I will say though, you do have to have at least Bison unlocked in your journal to get to the realm. Um, but we're gonna go over there, let me just get my rewards real quick, and then we'll head on over. We're here! <laughs> They have the item shop right here, of course, followed by the equipment shop is here. They did add some new accessories. I'm not sure what exactly what's new, but there's an ear bow. <laughs> Look at all of these. They're just so cute. Um, I'm a little bit broke, but that's okay. If you come see here, we've got the cosmetic contest over here. Um, there is an auction up here currently. There's plenty. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I know that this kind of market exists in their other games, like, um, Dragon Adventures and a bunch of other stuff, but I've never played those games. So it says that they have stalls coming soon, that we've got this beautiful area over here. <laughs> I think it's gorgeous, um, but again, I'm not super well versed with what their market realms typically look like in their other games. So, I'm currently broke, so I might have to grind a little bit. But look at all of this! <laughs> it's so pretty in here! Someone's asking a million for one of their horses. Is there is there such thing as a player who has a million coins that didn't buy it? Probably with Robux, if anybody has bought that. <laughs> look at this person's gargoyle! Oh, that is stunning! I kind of, I kind of strive to have one that pretty. I have a confession, I may have bought Robux to, um, to buy that pretty gargoyle I was looking at over here. <laughs> He's just so cute! I named him Walt. We're going back to the main server only so I can, <laughs> only so I can, um, I can grind some horses. I, I don't know why I didn't just get that on camera. His jump is just as, if not more, powerful than hers. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I kind of want to loop around and do that again. That was sick. Alright, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> this is what I was referring to the first time. Look at that! Look at him go! <laughs> it's so satisfying to watch. I'm pretty sure I just jumped over one of my friends doing that. <laughs> I didn't see who it was, but I'm so sorry. <laughs> I didn't see you join. And for context, I'm still in a public server. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Take a look at Fiesta behind me. I'm gonna speed up a little bit so you can see them better. But the random flare that I got was black butterflies and I gave them right to her. I think she looks so cute with them. The upside down horses! <laughs> Mine were also upside down when I loaded in. <laughs> Look at them go! <laughs> Walt and Fiesta are so cute. <laughs> I love them so much. Look at them! Let's get rid of these, these little bars. But oh my gosh, look at them! Waltz and Fiesta, my two battle tanks. That person over there with the big bison and the tiny one, they just walked across my screen and I went, oh, what a cute bison, and then the baby walked across my screen. I wish I was recording. Update from my last video, by the way. Um, I've already unlocked everything in my journal, so I don't know why I'm coming up to the worst place on the map. <laughs> Goat Mountain, or Gountain, as I've been calling it. <laughs> I cannot stand this mountain. It always hits me right off my horse. And I have never, ever tamed another one of these. However, I have learned it's pretty easy to outrun them. Um, like, like, like so. Like so. <laughs> Whee! It's, it's so easy to outrun them, actually. Why would they want to follow me? I've done nothing wrong. You know, if I wait for it to be daytime, this could be a pretty sick spot to get a photo. This is actually pretty sick. <laughs> and it's a pretty funny clip as well with uh, Fiesta absolutely flying around back there. <laughs> this is actually kind of funny to watch, I'm not gonna lie. 
I've been sitting here watching Fiesta go up and down the entire time. She's just been absolutely flying around, having the time of her life. I am desperately catching horses to get some money so I can breed my horses, hopefully breed something cool, and then take them to market. Um, but I want to show you guys a few things that my sister got from the market. I'm in her server currently. <laughs> Um, so I feel like I'll let her kind of take over a little bit on this video. Um, I think she's had more experience with the market since it came out, and I feel she can provide better information than I can. So this bison right here is a horse that she said that she got for 3000 from the market. As you can see, it's very pink, and it's super cute. This horse looks so much like cheese. <laughs> Why is it made out of cheese? <laughs> See one with wings over here. I wonder how much you would sell for. You could also just always take it to auction. Two thirty-five. Yeah, I'll take it. I have the urge to give a gargoyle common and uncommon food and just see how it goes. All right, I'm going in. So I failed too many times, so the game just cancelled my attempts. <laughs> and you know what? Valid. Alright, we can do it with proper foods this time. <laughs> so I was gonna get my sister in a call um, to tell you guys what she thought of the market, but she just left the call to call other people. <laughs> so I will text her my questions and have her answer via text. The questions I have chosen to ask my sister are as follows. What w would you say the auctions were a good idea, and why? Because she's been in here a lot longer than I have. <laughs> um, what is your favorite part of the new realm? Is there anything important? Is there any important information players should know about this new realm? And what extra tips do you have for players? I'll go ahead and put her answers up once she answers. <laughs> she's typing right now. So, I don't really have anything cool to put up, so we're just gonna put the unicycle up here. <laughs> um, I think... I think we're gonna just start it at... Ooh, what's a good starting price? Let me ask my sister. We are number 21 in the auction. <laughs> um, its name is Uni- Its name is Unicycle. I don't really want it. Um, and it's not that cool, so I've set it to the minimum bid. Uh, if people bid minimum, I'll take it. If they don't, and they go higher, I'll take it regardless. <laughs> The way you start an auction is by clicking up here, clicking create auction, and picking a horse. As you guys can see, I just put unicycle up. We caught unicycle entirely for the purpose of putting it up for auction. Uh, so that's it. Now we just sort of wait. When you want to bid on a current auction, you would go up to the top and select view auction up here. Um, that's what brings up that menu I just had up. <laughs> that's how you bid. While we wait, Mel has just answered my questions. So, to question one, she says, I do think the auctions were a good idea. It allows players to gain va the value for horses they spent a lot of work breeding, and for those to buy the horses they're struggling to breed or catch. For question two, she says, My favorite part of the new realm is actually the design. I adore the trees and the whole quote-unquote medieval summer market vibe to it. To question three, Mel says, Players should know that you will be required to have at least Bison unlocked to enter. However, this can be bypassed by joining a friend. Uh-oh. You do still need the horse breed to be unlocked to bid or purchase it. Past that, I would say you're good to go and it's a great realm. For question 4, Mel says, Extra tips I have for players is to have patience and don't beg for bids or beg to win an auction. If you want your horse sold, wait for that person that sees nothing but pure love for that horse. If you don't win an auction, it's not the end of the world. Another tip I'd say is to learn how to breed unique colors, as it can raise the value and demand of your auctioned horses. Happy bidding. This is actually Mel standing right next to me right now. <laughs> I am the highest bidder for this pink gargoyle, <laughs> and I really want it. It's gonna take like half of my money, but I really want it. 
<laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Yeah! <laughs> Let's go! Mine is also currently up. I don't think anyone's gonna want it, but you know, I tried. Nobody bought the unicorn, but it's completely okay. I've got a gargoyle in here. <laughs> Not a super cool one. It's got some little like blue on its butt, but that's okay. This is the lovely little, I think lady, let me check, yeah. The lovely little lady that I just bought. <laughs> oh, she's so cute. <laughs> I named her Queso. Oh, she's hitting a little jig. You know what? I think this is a good enough place to stop. <laughs> I'll do another auction video, I promise. It's just, I think, I think I can be happy with Queso. Look at her. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'll see you guys in another video. Let me know. Did you get anything cool at the auctions? Have you maybe not made it here yet? Is there anything you'd like to see in this game? Because... <laughs> I'll be honest, we've got a gap in Wild Horse Islands updates, so I'm probably going to be putting out a lot more videos that aren't Wild Horse Islands, so Horse Life, and pretty much any other game you guys suggest. So if there's anything you guys want to see, let me know in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching, remember to like, comment, subscribe, you can always unsubscribe later. Um, good morning for now!